Welcome to this video guys. In this video, we will install PyAuto GUI and Python in our Visual Studio code and create a sample project that uses PyAuto GUI and does some stuff. So let's get started. First, I'll create a new folder here for our project. If you already have a project, you can open that also. So let's click on new folder and I'll call it PyAuto GUI project. Select the folder. Okay. There seems to be an issue. Let me create the folder again. Okay, so select this folder. And this is empty now because this is a new project and it does not have any files. So I'll create a main.py here. And let's try some PyAuto GUI code. So I have this code here that just moves the mouse, clicks, writes something, and presses and holds a combination of keys and takes screenshot and finally shows a message. So Let's see how we can install PyAuto GI so that this actually runs. Now, in my case, it is showing select interpreter. In your case, it might be showing a Python version here. If it is showing a Python version, then no need to do this. But if you are seeing select interpreter, click on this and choose a Python version that is installed in your system. So let's choose 3.12 for now. In your case, you might just see one Python version, but since I have two installed, I was getting option to choose from two. Okay, so once Python version is selected here, as you can see, you are seeing this warning here that says import PyAuto GUI could not be resolved. That is because PyAuto GUI is not yet installed. Now, if I run this, as you can see, I get this error that says module not found, no module in PyAuto GUI. That is because this is not installed. So let's install this. Now here, type Python double dash version. And as you can see, the Python version here is the same as the Python version selected in my interpreter. So if it is different, you might have to change the Python version in your path. So check the link in the description below. I'll show you how you can do that. But if, the, if it's the same, you can just type Python and pip install py auto GUI. Hit enter and py auto GUI installation will start. So finally, py auto GUI is installed. And as you can see, the error is also gone. So let's try to run this and if let's see if everything works well. Again, click on this run button here. And as you can see, the mouse is moving itself. It is clicking somewhere. And yeah. So unable to import by screes. Okay, so there are some issues in the code here. I might have to fix this. But anyway, Pi Auto GUI is installed and the mouse was moving by itself. Now, this is how you can install PyAuto GUI. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.